That one I didn't he hesitate on. There we go, the rainbow. Another silvery rainbow. Oh, a sexy walt. Oh, that was quick. So here we are on the Lower Madison. I don't know the name of this spot, but it's a, a state fishing access site. I fished it a few times. Uh, what's really cool about it is this property over on the other side of the river is part of Ted Turner's property. And there's this flume over here on this little bluff I've researched it. I can't find anything. You know, it looks like something that, you know, they moved water. You know, I don't know if there was a, a little town over there at some point or a mine, but it's kind of cool. You know, it stayed there for over a hundred years now, it looks like. But I've got my 10 foot three weight Syndicate Pipeline Pro 2. I have on a, a three millimeter uh, sexy Walt and a two and a half millimeter zebra midge, and just like that, we get ourselves a little rainbow right off the bat. Actually, a pretty uh, a, a cutbow hybrid looking fish. It didn't want to stay around for a photo op. Another shiny rainbow. That's the thing with Euro nymphin, especially in cold water, the fish don't get really aggressive. I mean, they're willing to eat, but they don't move far. And I don't know if you saw it, but on that one, the cider just kind of started to hesitate, and I set the hook. And this little rainbow was on the zebra midge. Oh, had one right there. I did exactly what I, the opposite of what I said just a second ago is, I was watching that in the, the, cider, the cider, I was watching that cider and I saw everything pause and I hesitated just thinking it was the bottom and there was a fish just like that one. I saw it flash as I lifted up. So I had it briefly. This one we got to stick.
Another one already. Try this again. Oh, and he's off. Another little rainbow. So it's just a little bigger than the others. Nice pretty spots. 